Hello YouTube family. This is a queen who care who cares about you. I hope everybody day is going great on this tremendous Tuesday. Hope everybody is uh, doing well and safe. I'm at work at my new location I told you and I just wanted to do this quick video because I was just sitting here thinking you know how a couple of weeks ago I was um, at my security job and I was working 16 hours 12 hours and now I'm at a normal 40 hour job where I can have time to focus on doing the things that matter to me the most is you know doing my YouTube channel and working on other projects I have and you know what it just we are truly we are truly creators we really are truly creators we can create anything we want in this life don't let nobody tell you even the good book says uh, the book what's the what's the verse I'm looking for come on don't let me have a brain fog uh, we are created in God's image we are we are we are uh, little gods with the small g and we are truly creators we can create anything we want to all we have to do is believe it receive it and it will come to pass all you got to do is believe that you already have it and act in that manner like it already has came to pass in your life and you should have it so you know what anything you desire you want just speak it into the universe because it will come to pass all you got to do is meditate do your affirmations every day and believe that whatever you desire whatever you want and whatever you want to achieve in your life it will come to pass you just have to believe in it you know I hear a lot of people they say a lot of things different things well you know oh we don't know when our time is and oh our car got pulled I'm sorry to say, but I don't believe none of that. I truly believe that you can, you can, yeah, I know I got to go one day. It's, it's a point for me to die. But you know what? I believe that I can go when I say I want to go. I truly believe it. Yes, I will. I will leave this earth one day, but guess what? And I will leave with something, but guess what? It's going to be a great old age. Trust me, it's going to be a great old age. Because I got work to do. And I ain't, and just like Les Brown say, ain't over until I win. It's not over until I win. So I got too many things to do, and I got too many, I got too many uh, different advice and stuff, and and people to meet, and and people to meet, and places to go, and I have to do what I gotta do to do. I gotta do what I gotta do. So I can, my life can have a meaning now. Leaving a legacy. Creating memories. So that's what it's all about. Creating, share, um, spending time with your loved one and creating mem mem memories. And don't be having all this host hostile and mad with each other and you know, all this kind of stuff going on. It's not about that now. It's just too much going on. You have to create a legacy for your yourself and your 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 children and their children 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 this is what I'm doing now creating memories and legacies so long after I'm gone my great great grands or whatever they can say yeah that was my my great great grandma and, you know she was had her YouTube channel and she did she spoke and she encouraged people she did motivation whatever however they want to put it but I tell you you just speak what you want in that atmosphere. Believe that you already have achieved it and it will come to pass. It's no doubt in my mind that, because that's what I've been doing all my life. Even when I was a Christian. Hey, I, hey, they say you walk by faith, not by sight. I did just that. Just like I say, all you have, whatever you believe in, Buddha, Buddha, Allah, Yahweh, Whoever you want to believe in, Jesus Christ, whatever. If <laughs> all you got to do is put that out there in the atmosphere and speak it and believe it, because what whatever you whatever you hold in your mind, it 
it becomes in your hand. Whatever you hold in your mind, it becomes a reality right in front of you. Trust me and believe, because, I mean, time after time after time, it has happened to me numerous of times, over and over and over and over and over. And I just was sitting here, you know, I'm, on, I'm out here on my lunch break. And I was just thinking, you know what, I'm just going to do a, this quick video and just let the people know it. Which you probably already know and probably already heard many of times, but I just got to say it. But you ain't heard it from me. <laughs> so I got to say it. Hey, you can have anything you want. The sky is the limit. And you know what, I heard people say, oh... The sky is the limit. You know why people say the sky is the limit? Because it's no limit in the sky. You can just go up and up and up and up and up. It's no limit to that sky. You can go up, 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 up. It ain't no cutoff. You ain't gonna run into no wall up there. You ain't gonna run into no gates, no doors, no nothing. You can just go up, 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 up. Nah, you can't go up. You can't go up and just dress like this. But you got to be suited up the right way. <laughs> and then... And and then then <laughs> that that you still got to be careful because when you going up so far <laughs> you you can you can't breathe no matter what you're in. Right. With that being said, the sky's the limit. Don't let nobody put no put you in a box. And you think oh. I can't never go this place. I can never do this. I can't never do that. Mm -mm. You got to get out that box. Whatever you want to do, whatever your desire, your dreams, whatever you want to happen in your life, don't look at it as make it happen. Whatever you want to do, make it happen. You're going to face some challenges. Too. You're going to face some challenges. That's life. You going, you know, life is challenging. And you know what? Always say what don't what don't break you you learn from so everything is a lesson and a blessing and you have to take it with a grain of salt and move on to the next chapter in your book you got to keep it moving at all times don't let nobody um get don't surround yourself with toxic people that's um is going nowhere doing nothing they don't want to they, they ain't doing nothing and they don't want to see you go, do nothing but stay in one spot mm. excuse me y'all I'm eating a cherry that's all I can eat now because I'm on this D-Herbs that's another video in itself I'll probably do that one later on tonight but like I say don't let nobody put you in a box don't let nobody steal the box and throw it away. You be an extraordinary person doing extraordinary things. Because life is truly what you make it. It is truly what you make it. It can be good and it can be bad. And I know we all gonna face challenges. We're gonna be up and down, level to the ground. But guess what? As long as we breathe in the living, it's nothing that we can't do. Cause just like Hey, if you if you do researches on a lot of a lot of our ancestors' stories and stuff, they had to go through a whole lot of stuff to, to get where they wanted to be. But they they wanted it bad enough, and how bad you want it. Les Brown is one of my best motivated speakers, and just like he said, you gotta be hungry. <laughs> that is so true. You got to be hungry. Hungry is hell to get where you need to be in life. Because guess what? People is waiting on you. Some people is not going to be blessed until you show up. I'm going to say it again. Some people are not going to be blessed in their life until you show up. They are waiting on you. So you need to pull yourself up by your boot screens and move on. No matter what you then got what hand you've been dealt in life just do what you gotta do and move on in life because guess what when you don't do nothing that's when you don't fail 
When, when you don't do nothing in life, that's when you fail. So you got to keep it moving at all times. I'm looking at this video because I'm just hoping it ain't cutting off. Because I tell y'all, family, I got to get me a cam corner. Because I know I got cam... Did I say it right? Cam... Cam... Recorder? Cam quarter? <laughs> y'all got this... Excuse my... My language because you know I'm... I'm from the South. Savannah, Georgia. That's where I was born and raised. Well, so, sorry, not born and raised. First 12 years of my life, I spent in Savannah. Then after my grandmother passed, I came to Fort Lauderdale, Florida and there. But, I still got that Southern accent. But, it can be cute sometimes. <laughs> I'm here. But I got, I started my cleansing yesterday. And I can't eat nothing but all raw vegetables. Mm. That's a challenge. Now, I can do, I can do the, um, all veggies. Trust me, I can. Because I can cook them a little bit and, you know, toss them around and make little stuff. But with this, everything got to be raw, raw, raw. I'm, like, limited to, to what, yeah, I can eat, like, the, um, the, the owner of beer said, I heard him on an interview on YouTube. He said, oh, you can eat, you can eat anything you want to eat. No, no, I'm sorry. He said, you can eat all you want to, but, yeah, but. All they got to be raw. It's a limit to how much raw stuff you can eat. My goodness. Mm -mm -mm. But this is my second day. And like. I might come on later on. And I'm going to give y'all. And let y'all know about how that's going. It, I just started. Yesterday was kind of a little rough. Because I had a light little headache. But the day is better. But I tell you. It do clean out your system. And you know what? We need this at time. We need a good cleaning. We need to clean our body out. Twice a year. We be eating all this junk stuff. And I here eating in these restaurants. And eating stuff we ain't got no business eating. And we need a good cleaning and a good talk to clean our system out. So it can function properly like it should. Just like I was telling my sister every yes, the, the, the couple of days ago. We take care of our, we take our cars better than our body. We are going to make sure it got the right oils and fluid in there. But when it comes to our body... We want to just put old, any old thing. Oh, we, we want to ride around town. We want to ride way across town to get them good old cookies and good old barbecue sandwiches and pig and all that. Well, I don't eat that. I haven't had red meat in over 20 some years. I only stick to right now. I dip and dab in chicken. But when I come off this, I plan not to dip and dab in meat at all. Because <laughs> you know what? When you start something and you finish it, it be too much, too hard. But anyway, family, I'm going to end this video. And I just hope that I um, lifted somebody's spirit, encourage somebody, because guess what? We all need to encourage each other. Every day. <laughs> Excuse me. And I'm going to end my video, please, and I always forget to say this. Please, 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 subscribe to my channel. Please hit the like button, hit the notification for more, so you'll be notified for more videos. I'm a new channel coming up here, but you know what? One thing my famous motivated speaker Les Brown said, you don't have to be great to start, but guess what? You got to start to be great. And I'm going to end on that note. A queen who cares, cares for you. And y'all continue to have a blessed day. Peace.